After this elderly man was thrown out of a bank, a cop brought him back to take action. In our fast-paced, technology-driven society, elderly people can often feel a little left behind. But when one senior citizen from California encountered a bureaucratic problem at his bank, it required a heroic police officer to save the day. And his actions were truly heartwarming. A 92-year-old man walked into his local Bank of America branch one day in September 2017, hoping to withdraw some money from his account. His name was Jesus Rondel, and he was living in Montebello, a city in the county of Los Angeles, California. Unfortunately for Rongel, though, it wouldn't be a straightforward procedure. What should have taken just a couple of minutes ended up becoming a headache for the elderly gentleman. There was a simple reason why the bank clerk couldn't help him, however. In fact, Rangel's request to withdraw money from his account was refused due to something painfully straightforward. He thought that he brought along everything that he would need to get cash out, but it turned out that he hadn't. That's because his California ID card had expired. And as the important identification document was out of date, the employee behind the counter was unable to process his withdrawal. Unfortunately, it was a matter of company policy. Rungle therefore became frustrated with the bank clerk. He was unhappy that he had been told he couldn't get money out of his own account because of something as seemingly trivial as an expired ID card. But the clerk's hands were tied, he had to adhere to the company's rules. Nonetheless, the elderly gentleman wasn't prepared to go down without a fight. Things became so heated in the bank, in fact, that someone eventually called the police to report a disturbance. There was no denying the fact that Rongel was deeply upset about the state of affairs. And soon enough, the cops were on their way to deal with the situation. But when officers from Montebello Police Department arrived on the scene, they decided that reprimanding Rongel wasn't the best course of action. Instead, they had another idea, and it was a far better one. One cop in particular, Officer Robert Josette, was sympathetic towards Rongel. The elderly man was clearly in distress, after all. So, Josette decided that the best thing to do would be to try to help the senior citizen. First of all, the intuitive officer offered to drive Rongel somewhere. The police officer suggested that he drive Rongel down to the Department of Motor Vehicles, DMV, in order to renew his ID card. Josette knew that by doing so, Rongel would then be able to return to the bank and finally complete his withdrawal. So, off they went to the DMV. And before long, they had renewed Rangel's ID card and were back in the car, with only one destination in mind, the bank. Having successfully replaced the relevant identification card, Rongel was all set to try again to get a hold of some of his money. Once they arrived back at the bank, Rongel tried to start the withdrawal process once more. And this time, thankfully, things went much better for him. Indeed, he was able to take cash out from his account with no problems, and it was all thanks to one particularly compassionate police officer. Officer Josette had shown great kindness by taking Rongel down to the DMV to help him sort out the matter. Plenty of people would have dismissed the 92-year-old as a grumpy old man. But Josette instead took Rongel under his wing and saved the day. And the senior citizen was very grateful indeed. After successfully retrieving his money, he gave his heartfelt thanks to the kind officer before carrying on with his day. That wasn't the end of the story by any means, however. Soon, news of the incident in fact began to spread thanks to social media. The Montebello Police Department subsequently posted the story on their Facebook page, along with a photograph of Rongel being helped by an officer. It didn't take long for the post to attract attention, either, and soon it had been liked more than 260,000 times. 
The comments just kept on coming, too. It seemed that a lot of people were impressed by Officer Josette's actions that day. After all, he had gone above and beyond with the compassion that he had shown to a man in need of help. One commenter wrote that Josette was a very kind officer, adding that it was a sweet thing to do. Others even went as far as calling the cop a saint. The officer received particular praise for the emotional intelligence that he displayed, as well. All this little grandpa wants is to keep his independence. And the officer helped him in a dignified manner. Good job officer, one Facebook user commented. It was clearly very good PR for the police department as well. Ye Montebello PD, read one post by an individual who was clearly touched by the story. We need more stories like this to show the people that not all police officers are bad and that they go above and beyond their regular duties to help everyone, another comment said. It may also be true that the bank clerk could benefit from some sensitivity training when dealing with elderly customers, as one person suggested. It's clear, however, that Officer Josette didn't need any such help. Indeed, his actions that day indicated that he truly had been well trained to protect and serve his community.